During this time, a lot of schools are teaching virtually, and your kids might find themselves needing additional help to complete assignments. It's the perfect time to take advantage of our Homework Alabama website. It's linked to the Libraries page. Simply go to publiclibrary.cc and scroll down to the Learning section and click on Homework Alabama. You will find yourself on the main homeworkalabama.org website. You'll need to create a free account to use all the features on this site. Once you're signed in, you can scroll down and view the different services and the operating hours for each service. When you're ready, click Get Started. Across the top of the page, you will see all of the options available as well as your account settings. The first option is to connect with a tutor for one-on-one -on -one help. Keep in mind that hours are different for each service. You will need to fill out the topic and all of the information before you can request a tutor. Make sure you click the appropriate subject and your grade. You can also submit a paper for a 12-hour review. Make sure you select your appropriate library from the list and choose whether you are dropping off an essay or a resume for review. You can attach the files at the bottom and add any additional comments. Another great tool is the drop-off math question option. You can drop off a problem that you're stuck on and attach the file. You'll choose what type of algebra or math it is, and you'll select your grade level. You'll type in your additional questions, and you can even draw out your math problem. They'll try to get back to you within 24 hours with any help that they have. You also have the option to take assessment quizzes. Choose from a variety of subjects and types of quizzes that you would like to try. When you're ready, click on Take Quiz. You will see the question and multiple choice answers. Click Next until you have completed the quiz and then hit Finish Quiz where it will grade you and let you review your missed questions. And last but not least, under Other Tools, you will find various prep options for different standardized tests like the SAT and ACT, as well as videos on math and English. Let's look at the ACT prep. Click Prep for the ACT now, and you'll see Class 1 Lessons. Click on that, and the video lessons will begin for you to follow along with. You can also choose to go ahead and do some practice tests. You can choose what subject you want to start off with and whether or not you want to do an online test or a paper and pencil test. You can choose if you want it timed or untimed as well. You'll start your test and when you're finished with it, you will receive a score and a review when you complete the test. There are also additional resources available for preparing for college and ACTs. It's a great tool and it's definitely worth using. For more helpful video tutorials like this, please go to publiclibrary.cc forward slash tutorials.